Franklin Roosevelt said, Men and nature must work hand in hand. The throwing out of balance of the resources of nature throws out of balance also the lives of men. Hi everybody, you're watching a Happy Trails Hiking Park Travel Short. Today, we're exploring Cedar Breaks National Monument out in Utah. Cedar Breaks National Monument is located in Utah, right outside of Cedar City. This national monument was created by President Franklin Roosevelt in 1933. It was his first national monument declaration and set a precedent that FDR would follow again and again, transferring monuments and parks from the U.S. Forest Service to the National Park Service. The current visitor center that is shown here was built by the Civilian Conservation Corps, who worked in the area from 1934 through 1938. The name for the area came from the early pioneers. It was common to call Badlands breaks. And these early pioneers mistook the Utah juniper trees for cedar trees, thus the name Cedar Breaks. We have always shown up at Cedar Breaks National Monument during the Wildflower Festival. It's usually in July. Wildflower viewing isn't the only thing to do at Cedar Breaks National Monument. There are five hiking trails that range from easy to the rugged 9.8 mile Rattlesnake Creek Trail. These views are from the Alpine Pond Trail. There is also a 26 site campground available from mid-June to mid-March. Each site has a picnic table, a fire pit, or a grill. There are also restrooms with showers, firewood, and water spigots. Please check the rangers schedule for their ranger talks that happen throughout the year. You can also do stargazing here at Cedar Breaks National Monument. It hosts an annual series of star parties. They are free of charge and held during the summer months. We have certainly enjoyed our visits to Cedar Breaks National Monuments in the past. To see those full visits, please click the link above or in the description below. Till next time, this is Kay from Happy Trails Hiking. Thanks for watching.